Hey everybody, welcome to another episode of the Fire Me channel. Now today we are going to be buying another share of Delta. Now this might seem like the absolute worst time in the world to be buying the airline stocks. Warren Buffett's cashed out all of his. But I'm going to tell you why we're going to buy more. We're going to average down and why I really like Delta uh, and a couple others here as well. So number one, airline traffic right now on Delta is down about 95%. So in my mind, that leaves them nowhere to go but up. Uh, Delta is the best in breed, best in class airline. Um, the only second to them, I would say, would possibly be Southwest. Both of these companies have great balance sheets, but Delta is the one that we're going with. Um, they've, they're going to weather the storm. Uh, it, if there's companies that get restructured, they probably won't be one of them. There's several other airlines that are much more jeopardy of going under than Delta. And uh, if there's consolidation in the industry, that just means there's going to be more passengers for Delta and the other survivors. So I really like Delta here. Um, now the other p piece uh, to this whole thing is I lived through 9-11. Now when that happened, it was a tragedy, but every single airline uh, in the US and I think probably the world at that time collapsed overnight. The price went down, S future was uncertain, and uh, airline traffic is really consumer driven. So when people are, aren't flying, when people don't have money, they re airlines really get hurt. But I can tell you right now, people are dying to get back on the plane. Uh, not because they want to get on a plane, because they want to travel, they want to go on that vacation, they want to go to Hawaii, they want to go to the Caribbean, they want to start traveling again. Um, people are viewing this COVID uh, crisis as a short-term thing, which it is. Once they get a vaccine, I foresee travel to be business as usual. It might take uh, two, maybe in three years to ramp back up to where things were before, but things will return to normal. I'm fairly confident of that. And uh, just where I'm from, the average age of the people that are passing away from this COVID-19 is 82. So I think younger people are relatively uh, safe, not saying that something bad can't happen, but uh, if the, the younger person does get it, chances are you're going to have a good chance of surviving it. So, um, you know, younger folks are probably more likely to risk getting on a plane uh, even if they have to wear a mask on it for the next year or two and traveling somewhere for their vacation, which means ultimately that the airlines will come back up. Now, I like airlines more than uh, hotels. You could lump a bunch of these stocks together like rental cars, hotels, um, and other things that support this traveling industry, but I'm going to say airlines specifically because people need to get home, people need to go visit mom or dad, people need to go visit grandma, people need to travel for business. People don't necessarily have to stay in a hotel. There is several options. So that's why I like the airlines a little better than that. And I am optimistic that uh, sooner or later, um, life will return to normal. So when I say sooner or later, I am talking up to three years. So I do believe this is short-term pain. We're gonna use this opportunity to average down our position in Delta. And uh, not saying that the stock price can't go lower, but you know, this is a pretty good base, I think. And um, if Delta weathers this storm, there could be other companies that go through a consolidation, but uh, Delta, I'm fairly certain, will weather the storm they have right now. And uh, long term, I think they'll be back to that 50 to $60 range that they were previously. So let's go ahead and make this trade of Delta and uh, see how that goes. Okay, we'll be buying one share of Delta and averaging down. We'll do that as a limit buy. 22 dollars. One share. We'll confirm that and we will check back in a little bit to see if that gets filled. We're just checking back, no pending orders. And we're up to uh, three shares now of Delta. All right, uh, once again, that was a super simple to make that trade on the Wealth Simple Trade platform. Uh, 
If you don't have an online brokerage with free commissions, I recommend getting that, especially if you have a low net worth, uh, you know, well, simple trade, Robinhood, M1 Finance, any of those with free commissions is what you need to start with. Uh, you know, it lets you make these $2, $5, $10, $20 trades and buy one stock at a time uh, or one share at a time. And uh, it's great for people with a low net worth or don't have thousands and thousands of dollars to buy. Uh, buying an initial position. So definitely sign up for one if you haven't already. Uh, stick with the big names that uh, everyone's heard of and uh, hopefully you guys are doing well and we'll see you guys in the next video.